for today's video i'm going to show you how to turn this basic wall into a really cute background so i'm going to be using these command strip hook things and also a curtain rod i got from walmart for about four dollars okay so after i've mapped out about how long i want my backdrop to be i'm going to apply the command strips to the wall now i'm going to use my curtain rod to help measure the distance between both of the hooks now you can use a ruler if you want to be more precise but i didn't need one so it worked out for me but if you want something more precise then definitely do that okay so now that that's done i'm going to be adding this lightweight sheer fabric that i've been using for my photos and i'm just going to add it onto the rod i suggest using a lightweight fabric for this um just because i'm not sure how um, strong it actually is i don't know if i'd use any heavy fabric for it but i'm using this material because i've already had it Okay, so I want to show you what did the background look like once it was zoomed in. So now I'm going to be adding my props and I'll be sure to leave everything down below that I'll be using for my background. So I'm going to be using these clear thumbtacks to pull the fabric over the exposed wall just so I can have a little bit more coverage when it comes to taking pictures and doing my videos. And even though I can crop it out as well, like if it's still exposing, I still just like to, to stretch the fabric out just as far as I can. So now that everything's in place, I wanted to show you guys a finished picture of what it looks like. This is cropped and edited so you guys can see how it looks once everything is pulled together. So I hope this video helps inspire you guys to get creative with your backgrounds, especially if you're working with a smaller space like I am. And make sure you guys subscribe to my channel, click the notification bell, make sure you like this video and check my social media links down below. Don't forget to shop my store and shop notyourrichmama.com. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.